Hi, I'm Gigi, the creator of the Cocktail Fragrance Collection, and today I'm going to tell you how to tell the difference between a cheap perfume and an expensive perfume. Perfume, eau de parfum, eau de toilette, cologne, I'm sure you've heard all these terms before, but what do they mean? Basically, what they mean is the more essential oils in a fragrance, the more expensive the fragrance will be. The more alcohol, the cheaper the fragrance will be. Let's start with perfume. Oh, the best of the best. Pure fragrance, about 15 to 40% of essential oils in a perfume lasts all day, only need to use a little bit, and it's the purest form of fragrance. Now, the second most expensive fragrance would be the Eau de Parfum. That's what I've created for cocktail because that has 15 to 30% essential oils, not quite as much as a perfume. However, you are getting the same benefits because it lasts long, stays on all day, and a little goes a long way, and yet it's a little bit more affordable. Now let's talk about the eau de toilettes. This is where the higher alcohol content comes into play. Only uh, five to 10% of essential oils, so therefore your fragrance will only last maybe two hours, with an eau de parfum, six hours, and a regular pure perfume, eight hours. And then the cheapest of all, of course, is cologne. That has three to 8% of essential oils. So that will barely last, I don't know, an hour on you. So when you're looking for an expensive fragrance or a cheap fragrance, just know the more essential oils, the more expensive it'll be. See you next time.